Yeah. Well, I, I, I think one of the things is when I, what I learned is um, like pumps and designer insulins that are faster. Now, here's what, here's what we know in a free market. I'm also a serial entrepreneur. So I'm a, a free market guy, just like Sean is that people pay for convenience. They do yeah. in our world. They pay for Ozempic. They yeah. pay for quick loss, medical, medical loss, not bariatric you know, surgery, bariatric surgeries, all these things. Right. So there's a market for it. So you can't blame people for making things that right. people want. And it's probably going to make them a little bit more healthy. If that's why you want to look at it, us three here on this podcast can understand that because it's not good for the long term. However, what I saw was with my son is that a pump or designer insulins or anything that's going to make it more convenient for you to eat is a problem. Yeah. Eating should not be convenient. That's right. why it, I don't it, eat. Was, eating was not convenient. It never was. Ago. You had to go oh, hunt. <laughs> you had to go dig. Think, think about so, dessert. Okay, if you wanted to, you know, have an apple pie or something dude, like that. It oh, took four hours. Required, food required labor. Exactly. Right. And, and now it requires no labor. And so people are able to just, you know, um, eat eat like kings um, and, you know, get very many of the same diseases, interestingly enough. Yeah. Um, you know, yeah, and just absolutely destroy themselves. And, and that's the, the, you know, and listen. Uh, and I'm sure you guys talk about this, but uh, you know our um, food industry is complicit in this. Uh, the the poisons that they're putting in our food, the things that they've done to our food system. You know, there's there's some great evil there. Um, I you know they're they're kind of in the same cabal with the, um, the big pharma and everyone else. And so I you know I I have uh, I have sympathy uh, to a certain extent for people who are unaware of that stuff or don't realize they're being poisoned or got caught up in the marketing push that some of these companies have and you know oh no wait a second i eat low fat i eat l-i-t-e stuff all the time i don't and, understand and, and I don't, why i'm obese and i limit my eggs i get two eggs a week and i only eat red red meat yeah. once a month once a month i i don't have any i don't eat eat saturated fats and so i don't know why my brain's not working but you know <laughs> right right